So here's the twist. Nobody saw coming. For weeks, people have been shouting that 3i Atlas had cracked apart after perihelion. And today, the newest data flips that whole story on its head. We finally have a detailed contour map of the comet, and it's telling a very different story. Let's break it down. NEOAT just captured its sharpest look at three Atlas so far. The viewing geometry finally lined up. The background noise dropped and the image quality jumped. You can literally see structure in the coma that wasn't visible even a few days ago. This alone would have been interesting, but the real shock comes from what scientists did with that image. Next, using this new frame, researchers built a 40-level contour plot. Think of it as a topographic map, but instead of mapping height, it maps brightness. Every ring shows how the light intensity changes as you move away from the center. And here's the part that shut everyone up. The center is perfectly tight, perfectly concentric, perfectly circular. This is exactly what you expect from a single solid nucleus. If 3i Atlas had broken apart, the contour levels wouldn't look like this. You'd see a stretched or lopsided core. You'd see multiple brightness peaks. You'd see the entire structure wobble out of shape. Instead, it's clean, it's stable, it's symmetric. This is the strongest evidence so far that the nucleus is still in one piece. And right as this contour map came out, we also got a fresh amateur image from Puerto Rico that adds another layer to the story. It's not the cleanest scientific frame, but it shows something interesting, a faint curling in the tail. That's the kind of twist you'd expect if the nucleus is rotating roughly every 16 hours. A spinning body doesn't shed material in a straight line. The dust bends, it curves, and sometimes you get these subtle spiral patterns as sunlight pushes the stream outward. Now we have to take this one with a grain of salt because we don't know the exact stacking or processing behind the image. But even with that, it lines up with the bigger picture. A single intact nucleus that's rotating and throwing off material in a way that matches its activity levels. Nothing in this new tail shot suggests a breakup either. In fact, it reinforces the same conclusion. Whatever 3i Atlas is doing, it's doing it as one piece. Remember the drama from last week? People pointing at weird jets, huge asymmetry, strange dust behavior, and saying that meant the comet had fractured. All those arguments fall apart when you look at this plot. The jets and the dust may still be weird, but the core, the thing that actually matters, is intact. This is why scientists treat contour plots seriously. They expose structure you can't see in a normal photo. Drew Doss posted the update crediting the NEO SAT team, and the message was simple, the data is getting better. The view is getting sharper and nothing suggests a breakup. The plot backs that up completely. This also matches what JW and Lou reported earlier, still a single body, no fragmentation signatures. Now, here's where things get exciting. NASA is expected to release the high-rise images early this week. Maybe today, maybe tomorrow. High-rise has insane resolution. If there's even a hairline crack on that nucleus, it'll show up. And if the nucleus really is this stable, those images could be historic either way. This story is about to jump to a whole new level. So, yeah, three Atlas just proved everyone wrong. Not fractured, not falling apart. Still a single interstellar object flying through our system with some of the strangest behavior we've ever recorded. I'll update you the moment the high-rise images drop. Stay tuned, stay curious, and I'll see you in the next one.